Of course, it's been a difficult year for pro football and basketball fans. The NBA lockout means there may well be no pro basketball this year, and for a while the NFL lockout jeopardized this year's pro football season. There was no NFL players strike this year, but there was one 29 years ago. It began September 21st in 1982, and it ended November 16th. It was 29 years ago today, November 17th, 1982, that things were starting to get back to normal for a shortened NFL season, as we see now on Flashback. As a league has frozen all personnel. The NFL players' strike now settled. The open for business sign is back up at Schaefer Stadium. By noontime, players were back in the familiar surrounding of the team locker room. By 1.30, the players were out on the practice field for their first full contact workout in 57 days. Well, how do you feel getting back out there on the field today? Well, I'm still, I'm still a little ambivalent after this whole affair because I haven't had an opportunity to see exactly what I bought yet. So the NFL season resumes Sunday. The Patriots will play the Browns in Cleveland. Will there be as much fan interest after a 57-day walkout? Well, the truest test for fans in this area will come a week from Sunday when the Patriots play host to the Oilers. And these stands here at Schaefer Stadium will once again be occupied. Just how full they will be remains open to speculation. Patriots employees are gearing up for football, hoping to have four home games this season. So is most of the rest of Foxborough. But the local police aren't so happy. They rarely have Sundays off, and they've enjoyed the peace and quiet that the strike created. Although the next home game isn't until November 28th against the Houston Oilers, ticket sales today have been brisk. Only 15,000 left for that game. And that reporter at the ticket window is Carrie Jackson, who today is a top executive with the State Medical Society in Indiana. And perhaps you recognize that sports reporter who uh, was at Schaefer Stadium, as they called it then. He looked like he was 15. Oh, he hasn't changed much at Frank all. Frank Carpano. Of oh, course. my goodness. I'm, Kelly and I were like, is that Frank? Wow. And I believe that year, the shortened season, the Washington Redskins, I looked it up, the Washington Redskins won uh, the Super Bowl that year. Yeah, it was a shortened season, only, but I think either four or six games that year. That's, that's all they had time Not for. Not a lot. And Frank Carpano was 15. <laughs> okay. Or thereabouts. <laughs> we'll go with that. Looks Frank about, would like that. He looks about the same today as far as I'm He concerned. does. He looks great. Anyway, let's uh, check the weather.